Blink, squirt me. <laughs> you want me to squirt on you? No, I want oh. my squirt. Oh. Nope. <laughs> How's it going everybody? My name is Blake Schumacher and welcome back to the vlog. It feels so good to say that. It's been a fat minute since I made a video. I've really been trying to get back into it, but I've hit like a creative wall. Here's an accurate representation of that. Do your duty, Morgan. Oh, Jesus Christ. That, that's a sight. <laughs> <laughs> but with school ending and I'm about to graduate, that's crazy enough as it is. But with school ending, I do want to start getting back into making vlogs because once again, vlogs are my freaking favorite thing to do. I love doing it. I wish I had more time to do it, but with school, work, and I'm starting a new job too. But yeah, work's been giving me a lot of less, a lot less free time. School's been giving me a lot less free time. We're in the final three weeks of school, which makes me so happy. It's almost over. We're almost there! Woo! But yeah, I think it's about time. I break out of my comfort shell. I finally lock in, and I finally get over that wall. Oh, you're there! <laughs> yeah! Love you, Forgan. It's okay, Forgan. It's okay. I got socks on. So yeah. Let's get into the video. Before Savannah gets here, I got a big-ass canker sore right underneath my tongue. And I heard that mixing salt in water and then swishing it around for like 15 and 30 seconds helps. And although apparently it hurts really fucking bad, I'm gonna try it. It says to mix one teaspoon of salt in one half cup of water, warm water. Swirl this within your mouth for 15 to 30 seconds, then spit out. Repeat every few hours. I want to go now! I really don't want to do this. <sighs> this is gonna hurt. <laughs> That's fucking disgusting! God, it tastes just like Myrtle Beach! Oh my god, that tastes exactly like Myrtle Beach. I'm gonna get a glass of normal water before Savannah comes to pick my happy ass up. It didn't hurt as bad as I expected. That tastes disgusting. And it always will. Salt water is ass. Now the taste is just looming in my mouth. <laughs> Mr. Scanlon, what do you think of the pantyhose? What do you say? He said they look perfectly your size. <laughs> <laughs> if you're waiting for a waiter, doesn't that make you the waiter? How come if you transport a package by car, it's called a shipment, but if you transport it by boat, it's called cargo? <laughs> yeah. If you add a bed into the bedroom, you have more bedrooms, but less bedrooms. The Why person is it called a cold if you're warm? <laughs> the person who invented zero thinks for nothing. How come feet can smell but a nose can run? What is it? What is it? I'm gonna say mango habanero. It's not spicy. That's a lot. Yeah, that's, such, that's so cap. Eat what? I don't know what it is. What is that? I don't know. Spicy food. Come here, I should have brought my coffee. Before I tell you what it is, close your eyes. It's nothing bad, trust me, I just ate two. She's gonna ask him to feed it to him? I'm not pulling your tongue, put it open your hand. Don't look at it, just put it in your mouth. Trust me, just put it in your mouth. He missed, oh, no, okay, he got it. It's not bad, is it? It tastes like a whole ass What the fuck is it? The cricket. Ew! You just ate a cricket. Pure protein! Why the fuck do you have Edible crickets. Edible, or anything crickets edible. Crickets are edible. Yeah. Why would you bring those? Well, because I saw them and I was like, why not? <laughs> it tastes like an old ass raisin. Well, you see, it's not. Let me see it. Oh, that looks terrifying. Look at that. Very good. Well, I'm, he did not kiss you. It literally has the same texture. <laughs> yeah, I know. Can I kiss you? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong, Savannah? <laughs> she's, she's just cool. jealous of her fruity relationship. Apparently tonight there's supposed to be some pink moon. Last I checked we only had a white one, but apparently now it's pink. I'm gonna try to vlog that. I don't know how well it's gonna be on camera. I'm a little disappointed. 
The moon's not pink. On the camera, it looks like there's three of them. I guess that's better than a pink moon. So, it's turn time, and I needed more content for the vlog. So I obviously just sold out and went with Mr. Beast Burgers. Never had it yet. It's the first time trying it. Figured I'd do it on camera. P.S. We got the Chris Cup. Y'all got any beans? If you guys remember, the last time I tried food on this channel was the, uh... Travis Scott Burger. Moisturize. Cup holds up. Not too flimsy, but not too stiff. Uh, respectable character on the front. Holds liquids at a astounding weight. Cup gets a 10 out of 10. Very cup-like. Alright, now I'm just stretching for jokes. Let's crack open the food. Here, we got the uh, Beast-style fries. I don't think the Beast-style is supposed to be on this box. It's on this box. I got the Beast-style burger. But this is the Mr. Beast fries. How the fuck do you open this thing? Literally about to have to crack open my knife. Oh, it's all soggy. So what you can see in here, looks like there's some pickles, some relish, looks like ketchup, mayonnaise, onions, obviously fries. Oh boy, I'm not the biggest relish guy or pickle guy, but we're going to try it. I'm an idiot. It's not relish, stupid. That's ballpark mustard. It looks like there's also some bacon bits in here, too. If you're a mustard fan, you guys would like this. But if you're not like most normal people in the world, this probably isn't for you. Actually, if they got rid of the mustard, which I'm sure you could ask for, I just didn't see it. It would be so much better. But because of the mustard, I'm going to have to give it like a 3 out of 10. I'm going to eat a little bit of it. Because I need my money's worth. But it's not the best. You really gotta like mustard though. And now the holy grail. The reason behind this. Ooh, that is thick. The Mr. Beast Burger. I got mine beast style, but there's obviously Chandler style. I think there's Chris style and Carl style, which is literally just a grilled cheese. Now I just want the normal fries out of this. Even the fries are very plain. Yeah, the fries basically just taste like bar fries without anything on them. Yeah, the fries did not blow me away, but we're not here for the fries. We're here for the burger. And look at that bad boy. There's like nothing extra added to it. It's just, it's a thick burger. Actually, not even going to like dock points because most companies would like, the burger would look completely different online than it does in person. This looks fairly close to online. Like this is what was advertised. I kind of like that. I'm going to be full Gordon Ramsay here. Okay. I don't know... It tastes kind of bland. Granted, I wasn't expecting to be, like, blown away by it, but... It's a little bland. It's not bad, though. I will say that. I'm not gonna, like... It's not bad. It's just bland. Which, I mean... Basically, the style of food it is... It's coming out of a Bucca Beppo. So it's not gonna be, like... What's the word? It's not gonna be, like... Buca de Beppo is not a burger place. It's a, it's a Italian pasta place. So like I don't expect them to be the best, but I do expect a little better, Mr. Beast. Okay, so final conclusions on the Mr. Beast burger. It tastes like a burger you'd have, well, like a cookout, like Fourth of July. Your Uncle Dave's is flipping some burnt patties on the. Uh, the grill. They're all playing like cornhole or something, swimming in the pool, I don't know. Actually, I shouldn't even dock Uncle Dave's burgers. His burgers kind of smack. But yeah, for the burger, I'll give it like a six. I think six, five or six. No better than that. Speaking of ranking food, I literally just got finished with a whole conversation amongst my friends talking about doing the game show Chopped on this channel. If you guys would be interested in that, go down below, hit the like button, make sure you subscribe if you're new, by the way. 
now would be probably a good time to talk about why I wasn't uploading for a little bit. Now, again, I'm tripping over my words. So, the end of school is coming up as of today. I have 18 more days, including weekends, until I graduate as an adult. But yeah, I'm 18 days away from being a big boy. I get to put on the big boy pants, and I get to go to work. So yeah, I've kind of been buckling down on that, finishing schoolwork, finishing that up. Uh, my job, my actual job in another restaurant, better than these burgers. Uh, it's not taking a toll, but I mean, like, obviously, I have to prioritize that more than anything, because I need money to do stuff, you know? Savannah and I have been hanging around a lot. She's still around. Uh, today, when I'm filming, this is actually our 4-month anniversary. Hey, babe. I want to get her involved in more videos. I, like, she was in the last, ooh, one or two, I think. But yeah, I want to be able to film again. It's not like, she's not holding me back or anything. It's myself completely. But I do want to get back into filming YouTube, and I figured as summer's coming around, it's going to be, like, my last true summer, so might as well enjoy it, might as well do what I love, you know? I'm going to be completely honest, I've missed vlogging so much. I've been streaming on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Sojaglade, by the way. And I love streaming. I do. I actually just hit affiliate, which was the proudest moment of my entertainer career. Because I'm, like, actually making money off of content I create. And I want to do that on here, too. I want to make money doing YouTube videos, because I love making vlogs. But yeah, summer's coming around. We're going to get back into the swing of things. Getting all my friends to hang out, help me make videos. Not even just to help me make videos, but just to have fun. And when I when we have fun, I like to document it. We can always look back. And yet again, when we're having fun, usually you guys enjoy it too. But yeah, with summertime means more bonfires, and more bonfires means more skinnies getting punched in the mouth. But yeah, I'm going to scarf down the rest of this burger. I will see you all next week. That is the plan. I promise that's the plan. I'll have something. It might not be a full-length vlog, but it'll be something. I'm going to finish this burger. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Twitch is in the description. And I will see you all in the next video. Peace! Are you fucking serious? I couldn't even place a cup down in the center? God damn it.